When you think of microcurrent, if you've ever heard of it before, you might immediately think of a microcurrent facial. Ah, don't we all? So usually a microcurrent facial uses weak electrical signals to stimulate the muscles and skin. Some claim that this can reverse the visible signs of aging, such as drooping skin and dullness. Of course, the effects are not nearly as dramatic as surgical procedures like a facelift, and unlike invasive procedures, microcurrent facials involve no incisions, no anesthesia, no recovery time. So you might be wondering why I would let anyone send electrical currents to like the eyeballs or skin around the eyeballs. It sounds painful, right? Well, this is a do not try this at home moment, but we've actually started to see some interesting results in the ocular field. So let's talk about if there are any implications of microcurrent for dry eye disease, since this is a dry eye and eye channel. So what is microcurrent? Well, I had never heard of it before, but it is a device, microcurrent, to send weak electrical signals into the body. These devices apply extremely small microamp electrical currents to the tissues using electrodes that are placed on the skin. Now they work by delivering an electrical current to muscles and skin cells. The idea behind this is that the electrical current will build up muscles in the face, lifting and tightening the skin. 